Welcome, welcome, welcome. I am, you are, and this is. We're going to continue on with our alternate nostril breathing, breathing in with them fours. We will be on set two for today, where we will inhale, closing our right nostril, breathing in through our left for a count of four. Then breathe out the right nostril for a count of four, halfway. And then closing both nostrils for a count of four. Then do it on the uh, other side. We then to the right. Out to the left. And close. So once again, with our E, we have inhale. IH for inhale, EH for exhale, H for hold. And then the LN for left nostril, RN for right nostril, four for the number of seconds on each one. And on each inhale, you will expand the belly. And on each exhale, you will contract the belly. We have our visualizations going on as well with our eyes closed and crossed during this practice. Our feet flat on the floor, back straight, shoulder blades back just a bit. We shall begin with three ohms. The exhale and then on. How you feel? How you feel sitting on the meal from a dollar bill? Hey. Always take note of how you feeling. Your befores, during, and afters. And be honest with yourself, for real, for real. Take note of how you feel when you do your ohms. Before your durings and your afters. Because the more you practice, shit, you won't even have to take note no more. Cause it's just gonna be like a heartbeat. You know what I'm saying? Like you'll be doing ohms on your way into work. You'll just be. So, self healing. That's what we have for. Let's get it. So, let's go ahead and jump into this set two that 444 four, four, left nostril, right nostril, hold. Right nostril, left nostril, hold. Now, do remember, this is me. So, I'm going off my count and I'm going off my flow. 
whenever you're doing this practice, whether you're doing it with me or you're doing it on your own, for real, for real. Um, if you need a, if you want to put a instrumental in there, work off a certain beat, do that. I got hundreds and thousands of instrumentals. So do meditations with as well. And during these practices, um, also look to further yourself whenever you're closing your eyes to have a counter there. One, two, three, four. At the beginning, maybe it's you doing it audibly, loud, out loud, so you can hear it. Eventually, there will be a time where it's just the counter is going to be there. You will see it with your mind's eye. All right. That's good. Set two. Deep exhale. We're doing sets of 12. Let's begin. Halfway there.
That's it. Allow your breath, your body to react, respond, adjust itself, and activate. Burps and farts are wonderful. Expelling air, expelling pressure. As above, so below. <clears throat> Take note of the breath flowing through your body, the lightness you feel. That pineal popping, enjoy. Enjoy. Shit, as of right now, you can go ahead and push the stop button on this motherfucker and go into your meditation. You can go ahead and talk to your spirit guys you want to. Ancestor, mm-hmm, hire yourself. Go and go to the beach and stand atop of a mountain. Go breathe underwater. Do a Merkaba and she man but as for those who still here still standing still strong let's go ahead and hit that cool down Conscious breath, six, three, six, three, that pranic breath. So inhale for six, through the nose, expand the belly, hold for three, exhale for six, hold for three. Then we'll do our three ohms, then we out. Hmm. Let's go ahead and do that six, three, six, three. Deep exhale. Inhale. Surround yourself with brown. If you're going back to work, going back to the kids, going. I'm sure we about to go to basketball practice. So surround myself with brown because I'm, you know, doing that breath, man, that retention. And you know what I'm saying? You, you can be high than a motherfucker. You don't want to be so high that you don't want to come back down. So surround yourself with brown. Make a commercial out of that. 
Anytime you time anytime you need to ground, go surround yourself with brown. And I have like me just going through hugging people. Go ahead, slide into that pool of chocolate. Roll around. Paint yourself with brown, laying some brown leaves. Picture yourself jumping into a pile of brown leaves. Or a tree bark. We'll finish up with three ohms. Deep exhale. Inhale. Ohm. Free to freely feel. Love, peace, motherfucking chicken grease. Have a good day. As and it's. Your mom. It's like a, a chuckle joke. What do you think? Uh, what do you think? How many pairs of those do you have? Just this. It's, That's it? it's expensive. Oh. Because you had to pay per face. That's awesome. You think she'll like them? Do the yeah. sock wear. It's she like, well, it's like a, what do you call it? Gag gift? Like she's going to open it and be like, oh, because she did it for her brother with one of his puppets. Remember he does Danny Doe's Treehouse? Anyway else? So if we have a little bit of T I M E. So yeah, come up, come back through there, do that four, four, four. Um, especially on your progressions, that four and four left and right. Going on the set two with the four, 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 the left, right, hold. And then I'm gonna move on to the set three. You know what I'm saying? Where you're doing the left hold and then you're right. And you move up from there to four, 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 four. Left hold, right hold. Right hold, left hold. And you can do all sorts of numbers, you know. Of course your threes and your twos. You get up to your fives and your sixes. And then maybe on your four, on on your uh, set three, maybe you wanna do Three on the inhale, six on the on the hold, and then six on the exhale. You know, you want to go three six six or three six three. Or however, you can play with it how you want to play with it. It's having that confidence and that consistency to do it multiple times daily as well. And once you're doing it multiple times daily. You'll be living it. Like during conversations, you'll be breathing deeply. Instead of looking to retort, looking to react, looking to respond, um, masterminding your response while they're talking, you'll just be listening. 
it will throw some people off. They will look at you and just be like, are you? Don't, it, and maybe those first couple of times you may fight it. Cause, you know, it's, Cause it's like, how come anyone isn't seeing what I'm doing? What you ain't had dreams before? Of course nobody sees what you're doing. Then again, feels like that's what the ego's for. So feed that ego how you need to feed it. Take it shopping. Take it outside to play. Go hit some layups. You know? Sometimes you don't like shooting three so much because you, you just want to see the ball go in. Go hit some easy shots. Guarantee your ego will get tired of hitting them easy shots and you'll go shoot some other ones. <laughs> so, enjoy. As well as... Using the breath is definitely something we can use when we are getting into our magic as well. Reading basic sense of magic, um, critical self-analysis and those sorts of things and know thyself, washing your ego clean. Looking at things from a different angle, from a spiritual sense, meaning from a metaphysical meaning, more than just what the two eyes perceive. The first eye as well as your senses, using those. Building yourself an altar, the sun, moon centering, the cosmic sphere for protection and the four gateways of power, air, fire, uh, water, earth. Plus you got the colors to go with that as well. Um, so using the conscious breathing, um, using the um, working the alternate nostril breathing works well if there's any nerves in here, you know what I'm saying? Where there's nerves of maybe you grew up in a certain religion that and, and it was looked down upon. Those thought forms may still be in you. And using that breathing, saying, having those intentions beforehand, you can clear out the cobwebs, even though spiders and spinning very much needed. So enjoy basic sigil magic, Philip Koopa. Put that in the description as well. I am, you are, and this is. Oh.